High School Hoops, Hall of Famer Willie Thomas has led White Knoll to a 2-0 start in Region 4-5A, but the toughest test of the season was on the docket tonight as Lexington coming in to Red Bank, ranked as the top team in the state in Class 5A, and Cam, Cam Scott, hammer time. That was the start of a big night for him. But the Timberwolves trying to hang around. Brandon Griffin to McCoy Bell. He scores inside. More from the Timberwolves. Morgan Washington will dial up, and he will hit. But Lexington can score in so many ways. Watch Caleb Evans driving, and this is a smooth move for two off the glass and in. Nicely done. Back to Scott, the Texas I &E, three ball and one from the baseline. A four point play for Cam, and this is how he leaves the stage going into halftime. The buzzer beater for three. Cam with 43 points on the night. And Lexington goes on to win it by a final of 95 to 53. In the girls game, Lexington could go to 3-0 in the region with a road win over White Knoll. For the Timberwolves, good passing. Shaylin Hayes to Samantha Keeley. She scores inside for the Timberwolves. White Knoll has it again, but this time it's Keeley's turn to set up her teammate, and Hayes from long range off the glass and good. White Knoll hanging around. But Lexington starts to get some separation. Jordan Catino from the baseline, her three. And the pose is good. And then Catino inside to Cindy Anderson. Makes herself a target on the block. She scores inside for the Wildcats. Off the miss, Evie Godfrey alertly finds Izzy Seville. Bucket and one for the Wildcats. And Lexington wins by a final of 52 to 40.